Now that we found oxygen in Venus's atmosphere, it might be time to consider if it's a better planet to colonize. It's very possible that our solar system used to have three habitable planets, Earth, Mars, and Venus. And a lot of the conversation recently has been about getting humans to and colonizing Mars. But here's the problem. Mars has about half the gravity than Earth, no atmosphere, solar storms, crazy high levels of radiation, and it's freezing cold, which isn't really a comfortable place for anyone to live. On top of that, it will take astronauts about seven months to get there, which experts have warned will probably cause them severe psychological stress. But Venus is a lot closer, and while its surface might just be as hellish as you could possibly imagine, that's not where you should be looking. About 50 kilometers up from its surface, Venus has an airspace with similar gravity, pressure, and solar radiation to Earth, with an average temperature that ranges from 30 to 50 degrees Celsius. Now, the catch here is, is that we would have to live in floating cities that stayed within the airspace. But it is actually pretty feasible, which is why NASA released their Habitat concept in 2015, which would be a 30-day manned mission floating through Venus's atmosphere. So while you or I probably won't ever be living in the skies of Venus, our grandchildren just might be.